Hey YouTube, hey Bold and the Beautiful fans, OMG, Carter is busted. Rich found Carter's signature on those LLC papers. So what happens now? Is Carter and Hope's takeover plan over before it even begins? Let's get into it. So we saw today Carter give those LLC papers to Ridge and Steffi to sign. And of course, earlier Carter was arguing with Ridge and Steffi about Hope and Carter was imploring them to give Hope another chance. After the argument, Ridge asked for those papers, those LLC papers. And Carter said he has them right here. So what are these LLC papers all about? Well, they have to do with Forster Creations not having to pay taxes that they don't need to. And we the fans too, of course, know that Carter and Hope are using these LLC papers to take over the company by having Carter sign his name as the manager of the LLC, okay? And this would put Carter in control, okay? And so all they need is Ridge and Steffi's signatures and then Carter and Hope can pull off their takeover plan. This is a huge ambitious plan that would shake up Forrester Creations. Carter even dropped plenty of hints today that Ridge and Steffi should change their decision about Hope and Hope for the Future. Change it right now before it's too late. And that more rests on this decision than you could possibly know. Is Carter dropping too many hints though? Will Steffi and Ridge become suspicious that something's up? Carter also said the future of Forrester Creations will never be the same if you don't listen to me, if you don't heed my advice. So after all of this, the big question is, would they sign? Would Steffi and Ridge sign the papers? The anticipation was building up. But then Ridge asked for the LLC papers and they began signing. Everything was going well. They were going through the paperwork and Carter was telling them where to sign. Steffi finished her signatures and then they needed Ridge to sign one last time, but Ridge lost his place in the paperwork. And that's when he saw Carter's signature. Carter Walton, why did you sign this? Asks Rich. What's going on? Oh no, busted. So what happens next? Is the takeover plan failing to launch? Well, not so fast. Spoilers indicate that this could still happen because we know Brooke is going to find out about this plan when she overhears Carter and Hope talking. Spoilers say Brooke learns a shocking truth. So maybe that means the plan is still in play and maybe Carter was able to downplay why his signature is there. Maybe Carter tricks Ridge and Steffi into thinking his signature is supposed to be there. We'll see. Carter will have to think fast, so we'll see what he tells Ridge. Carter will have to provide a plausible explanation as to why his signature is there. So stay tuned to see what Carter says and how this plays out. Carter could very well be walking out of the CEO office with those signed papers with Steffi and Ridge's signatures, so we'll see. Also, spoilers say that Ridge feels Carter is indispensable, but Steffi questions his loyalty to the Foresters. So it'll be interesting to see the context of this conversation. Is it because Carter is busted and they're thinking of firing him, but maybe Ridge doesn't want to because he's indispensable, or Maybe Carter does get Steffi and Ridge's signatures and Carter was able to explain why his own signature is there. And after Carter leaves, Steffi and Ridge will continue to discuss how Carter's been defending Hope. If Ridge busts Carter, then maybe Ridge wouldn't think Carter is indispensable. So maybe this spoiler indicates that Carter will get those signatures and get away with it. Carter told Hope, wait for my call. Our lives could be changed. Is Hope going to get that call? How is this all going to unfold? Will Hope and Carter have something to celebrate? Carter and Hope's plan could still be very much alive, but we know Brooke is going to find out and what's she going to do. So stay tuned to see what happens next. We'll keep updates coming on this incredible story. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Keep it right here for more updates. Watch The Bold and the Beautiful, CBS Daytime and Paramount Plus, and I'll see you in the next video.